Hey everyone, I'm Ryan here from, uh, Explor from Ryan's Explorations. It's been a bit. Um, I just haven't had the time to get to any places and record any places because I've been busy. But uh, I've got, you don't want to hear me do uh, have my explanation, but in front of me is the Warrington TGI Fridays. And it literally just closed a few days ago, actually. And they took everything down at this one as well, just like the one at Montgomeryville. But uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Uh, label scars behind never will get to that. They go all around the building. And I was here just a couple days before it closed. Me and my dad were here eating for dinner. Um, which, it wasn't doing terrible business. There was quite a bit of people here, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I almost, I honestly almost thought it would open, but <laughs> yeah, they still got lights, all the fixtures and everything in there. A truck in the background that's my dad <laughs> yeah man. we've been uh i think we were here i forget exactly when but sorry, it's not just this tga fridays a lot of them have been closing recently and i don't know why i'm guessing because of poor business but I don't know, and over there, there, there's a giant, they're actually remodeling it. That's the one I recorded uh, a while ago. I recorded the giant over there a while ago, they're turning it into something. And there's also an Easton, Easton Buffet over there, but I'm not gonna record that because all the windows and everything are shut. They still have the label scar, or not the label scar, they still have the lettering up there but I'm not gonna bother recording it because you can't really see anything in there. And there is the TGI Friday's label scar. And let's see if it can, can't see anything in there. This one you're able to see quite a bit. Yeah, there's security on this, so I'm not gonna bother. Yeah, like I said, I don't know, there's a mailbox. Um, there's a label scar, like I said, but I have no idea why these TGI Fridays are closing, but if any of you know, drop a comment down below and let me know. Cause like I said, I for like a millionth time, I was here a couple days beforehand. I'm not even gonna try that. I was here a couple days beforehand, like before it closed, eating dinner. And I don't know why it closed. Like the one in Montgomeryville just closed randomly too. Cause I was here the other day and I saw a bunch of people in there and they were taking down the signs and stuff. Like other than the one in Montgomeryville, I just went past there one day and it was just closed. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna go in there. <laughs> It's windy. And then there's the other label scar. There's the target lens, it's back there. But I think that's pretty much all we're gonna get out of this video. Sorry if it was short, but I just wanted to get the sense since I haven't recorded anything in a while. But yeah. So apologies if that video was a little bit fast. Uh, there are, it's like midday Saturday, so there's a lot of people in the shopping center. And, um, yeah, I just didn't want them to act suspicious or anything. Is it? Yeah, the Joanne Fabrics, the Target, they're remodeling that giant into something, which I can't really tell. And then over there's the Easton Buffet. They still have the signs and everything up, but I'm not going to bother recording it because, like, it's closed, but all, this, all the windows are um, closed, so I can't really, I'm not going to really get that much in it. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. 
and I will see you all next time. There it is. Have a good day and goodbye.